Hello football lovers, today we will preview the week 7 at Sports Corner. In the match of Jags vs Saints, my pick will be Jags. If we compare the league rankings, Jaguars are better in offense, passing and rushing, while the Saints are a better team defensively. If we see the quarterback performance, the Trevor Lawrence uh, has got 7 touchdowns with 3 interceptions. He started the season a bit sloppy, but now he seems to be in rhythm. In the rush department, Etienne has been good with 5 touchdowns, and the receivers, both Kirk and Gridley, have 2-2 two -two touchdowns. If we see Saints quarterback performance, Derek Carr has been okay. Uh, with five touchdowns and three interceptions and their rush department has also been okay with Elvin Kamara uh, in receivers Oleve has been sensational at time in team stats uh, both teams are almost at par with each other in total yards passing yards rushing yards and yards per play Jaguars are only ahead in points per game if we analyze the defensive performance of the both teams, the Jaguars defense has been poor which can be seen in the yards allowed. Saints has more rushing yards allowed than uh, Jaguars. Jaguars are ahead in fumble recoveries and allowed third down efficiency. If we see Raiders vs Bears, my pick will be Raiders. Raiders are better defensively and Bears are only way ahead in rushing. If we see the quarterback performance, Jimmy G has been a little bit sloppy. In rushers, uh, Jacobs has been good. In receivers, Devante Adams has been spectacular and he wants the ball more. The status of Justin Fields has been questionable with dislocated thumb. Their receiver performance was also excellent in the recent game. The only department where the Bears have uh, edge is the rush department. Bears are ahead in points per game. Raiders have thrown uh, interception a uh, bit concern. Bears have allowed more passing yards and the Raiders have allowed more rush yard. Bears have more points allowed and Raiders are good with the sack. In Bills vs Patriots, my pick will be Bill. Bills are leading in every department except defense. Josh Allen has been good but inconsistent and in receivers Dig has been sensational. For Patriot Matt John has been awful. He has thrown more interception than touchdown. It's due to his turnovers, the rushing and passing department also look average. Bills are ahead offensively in every stat. They are way ahead in points per game and third down conversion rate. Bill's defense has been good at interceptions and sacks, so Mac Jones have to be careful in order to survive. In Falcon vs Buccaneers, my pick will be Buccaneers. Although Bucks are behind in almost every department except defense, the quarterback Ridder's performance has been average with equal uh, touchdown to interception ratio. The receiver squad has been good enough. Baker Mayfield has been spectacular with 7 touchdowns so far. In receivers, Mike Evan took some sensational catches. In team stats, Atlanta seems better offensively. Defensively, Bucks has been ahead as they have more interception and sacks. Now we see Seahawks vs Cardinals. My pick would be Seahawks. They are good defensive team compared to Falcons. Uh, Falcons are far ahead in rushing. The quarterback Dobbs has been very good along with his rushers and receivers. In Seahawks lineup, Geno Smith has been in great form along with Walker and DK Metcalf. Cardinals are ahead in total yards and rushing yards. Cardinal defense has more rush yard allowed and points allowed. In Chiefs vs Chargers, it's no brainer to pick Chiefs. They are better in league ranking in every department. Chargers quarterback Herbert has been very good. Chiefs quarterback Mahomes has been little sloppy which you can see interception section. Their rush and receiving squad has been excellent and the Isaiah Pacheco will be the real threat to the Cardinals. Chiefs are better in every team stat. 
especially in total yards, Mahomes should be real threat to this team. Chargers have more points allowed and passing yards allowed. In Lions vs Ravens, my pick would be Lions. Their league rankings are better in offense and passing. Ravens are better in defense and rushing. Goff has been exceptional this year. He threw 11 touchdowns. In Russia's David Montgomery has been a standout performer and the receivers are also good. Ravens quarterback Lamar Jackson has been great, but not clutch as we ex expect him to be. He has 5 passing touchdowns and 4 rushing touchdowns. The receivers also performed well. In team stats, both teams are almost at par with each other. The Baltimore has only rushing advantage. Ravens have more rushing yard allowed, so David Montgomery will be a real threat to them. Ravens have more sacks, so Jared Goff will be under their defense radar. In Browns vs Colts, my pick is Browns. They are number one defensively and ahead in rushing. Quarterback Deshaun Watson has been okay and will be playing. Colts main quarterback Anthony Richard has been injured, so offense will be struggling I guess. You can see the defense superiority of the Browns in allowed yards. In Commander vs Giants, my pick is Commanders. They are better offensively in the league rankings. Their quarterback Sam Hall has been okay with some inconsistency. Giants quarterback has been pathetic with more interception than touchdown ratio. In team stats, Commanders are better. Commanders are ahead in points per game. In the rest of the stats, both teams are at par with each other. Defensively, Commanders are ahead in sacks and interception. In Rams vs Steelers, my pick is Rams. Rams are better in league rankings. Steeler quarterback is also average due to which the offense is very bad. Matthew Stafford has been good and their rusher K. Williams has also been a star. The receivers also perform very well. Steelers are behind offensively and Steelers are ahead defensively. In Packers vs Broncos, my pick is Packers. Packers are better defensive team. Jordan Love is a bit concerned with his form. Russell Wilson has been spectacular with 12 touchdowns along with Sutton in receivers. Broncos are ahead in offensive stats. And Broncos are behind in defensive stats. In Dolphin vs Eagles, I will go with Eagles. Eagles have elite defense, though Do Dolphins are number one offensively. The offensive line of Dolphin is full of firepower, starting from quarterback, rushers, and receivers. Jalen Hurt is a bit concerned for Eagles as he is not precisely throwing. The rushing and receiving departments are good. The Dolphin have slight edge offensively. The defensive stats are almost at par with each other. In 49ers vs Viking, my obvious choice is 49ers. They are ahead in league rankings of every department. Their offense has been great with Purdy and CMC. Cousins has been excellent but Jefferson is injured. 49ers are ahead in rush yard due to CMC effect. The defense of the Viking has been very poor which you can see in yards allowed. I hope you like this video. Hit like and subscribe for more videos.